now I've got access to the batteries and I think the thing is it doesn't charge unless um, you actually have some charge in there I don't know if it's something to do with that or it might have been due to the fluid level being too low or something like that because I had to put I've got a, a thing there where you feed uh, water into it and it goes along these pipes here and fills and uh, I, the car came with they'd got some water with it and it was there was about four litres I think in total of deionized or whatever it is more water right and it took it all the whole four litres you know so I mean these batteries aren't massive I'm pretty sure that so you know we had a problem with basically exposed uh, exposed plates which is the reason why those were all flat these two are okay on this side which is where it comes in but those weren't and I'm thinking they just didn't top it up properly or at all <laughs> right and so what I had to do is basically I'd, I've got two car 12, 12 volt chargers where are they at? There, those two there <coughs> so I hooked uh, a pair of uh, the uh, 6 volts to one and another pair up to the other and just left it to charge for an hour right and then after an hour I swapped it to the other pair two pairs right so they, they had an hour each of a what is quite a low power charger basically just to get to the point where they had a reg registering voltage and water in them I filled them up with water obviously now I've connected up the main charger and it's now registering that it's charging it in fact let me just get the, uh, the old voltmeter <coughs> and uh, when I finished charging with the car battery chargers I was only getting about 40 volt it was only registering about 40 volts Let's put this on. Right. <coughs> it's DC. Okay. Do this one handed. So this is going to be firm. Right, so and uh, just so you know that it's arranged so that there it's kind of a sequence of like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So the plus and the minuses are here. Um, that's a negative because it says neg, right? So we put a negative on there. Okay, squeeze it around a bit. And the positive one's over here. So I'm stick the positive in there. And I'm getting nothing, why? Oh, is it because it's not touching? There you go. There, see? So now it's showing a charging voltage. Obviously, this is charging at a higher rate than the car battery charges. And 57.61 uh, volts across the whole pack. And it's a 48 volt pack. Um, <coughs> in order to register, the, the uh, optimum voltage for the battery that is at a cell apparently is 2.1 volts per cell. If it's a 2.1 volts per cell uh, after a period of time, like a you know a settled voltage then the 